So this is going to be um, a Grand Theft Auto 5 um, game review. And um, I just want to start off with, um, depending on whether you're a big multiplayer fan or a campaign, um, both of them are very good. I'm not into the storyline myself, but heard a lot of good things about it. And um, I've played a little bit of it. I'm more set on online right now just because I don't like playing alone. So it really depends on what you're getting it for. Um, I mean, the online, you've got plenty of options. You can play with your friends, start crews, um, you know, do basically whatever you want to do on the game. I mean, you know, rob stores, buy apartments. Uh, you know, you, you really have a big selection of things you can do together. I mean, and with 16 people in the multiplayer, um, people you can fight, join with, um, it can be, you know, really fun. Um, so some key things that I've liked about it so far um, are just is a lot of the play style I mean um, it's really fun uh, I mean at first I didn't wasn't really into it too much but later on when I actually got into um, more of the online and started to understand um, the gameplay I started to really enjoy it um, I mean I like the options I mean you know, you can go into a store, buy new clothes. Um, you know, there's just so many different little options that you can do. I mean, golf, tennis. Um, you can drive basically anything you want to drive. Um, and there's just new things being unlocked every time. I mean, and at, you're at a thousand level um, cap rank, uh, so that's really nice. I'm only at level seven; it's taking forever. So you're gonna have a lot of time that you're gonna have to spend to level up, um, which can be a good thing. Um, the only downfall that I've found so far is you can't play an actual story together, which is irritating. I mean, there's missions you can do alone, but not very often. Most of the time you're going to have to have at least a minimum of four players in the game. Um, I mean, you can play it by yourself, but people can join in and stuff, so you're going to get caught with that sometimes. Um, so it's definitely a game I would prefer. Um, and even with the Xbox One coming out, I would still get it. Um, the game. I mean, I don't know if they'll redo it on the Xbox One, but um, just to show that I do have the copy of it. So, um, you're going to actually open it up. And, um, one second. Mine actually came with a map of the whole place. Um, I don't know how much good that does. If you want to hang it on your wall. Um, and then you're going to see disc one is going to be the installation. And then this too is going to be the game. Um, and for all of you out there, um, the online is up and running. So if you're feeling um, feeling online gameplay, you guys can play it right now. And um, so yeah, a rough part about the game is it is very difficult to make money, depending on whether you're good at the game or not. Um, I suck at making money, especially because when you get killed, you can lose anywhere from. Um, one thousand to sometimes three thousand dollars per death and even if the money's in your bank I thought that was a stupid feature but uh, games have other things so but yeah I just kinda wanted to give a review um, if you're looking for a good game to buy I would definitely go out buy it ASAP um, I'll do another game review um, soon thank you